Hey Lab Rats, my name is Darren or Lab Shenanigans and today I'm here to do another review of Micropipetters. Um, last time I did a review of Gilson and I was kind of unhappy with the products to be honest but this time I'm reviewing Eppendorf. I'll be judging on three things, functionality, comfortability, and appearance. Alright, so I want to preface that everything on this table is completely sterile. First item I want to review is the P1000. P1000? Alright guys, so today I want to review the P1000. First impression, I love, love, love the color scheme. Navy blue, dark gray, and a lighter gray. I think it's a very it's a very wise color scheme. I think the shape of it is very well constructed. It's boxy up here and then it slowly tapers off down here. I like how it's not round. I like how, um, I guess, boxy it is. It kind of gives it a slightly futuristic look. I like the subtle brand logo, Eppendorf, on both sides. It's not too big and the logo itself is, I think it's a good design. It's not too fancy, it's subtle, it's very minimalistic. I like how it has a label right here, it's a P1000, so you know exactly what it is. So, appearance-wise, I'd give this an 8 out of 10. Alright, so next I'm going to look for, um, I'm going to judge it on comfortability. Right off the bat, I think it fits very well in my hand. Pushing down on it, it feels... It's not too bad, I, I like it because compared to Gilson... You don't have to put so much force. This? Ooh. <laughs> Today we'll be listening to me turn the knob on my micro better and just close our eyes and we'll go to sleep together, okay? <laughs> so for comfortability, I would give this... Bitch, I would give this a 10 out of 10! It's so comfortable, like... For real though, like, it's so comfortable, you don't have to put so much force to push this down, and it fits in my hand perfectly, I don't feel, I feel like I can do this all day and it will not hurt my thumb at all. So yeah, 10 out of 10. So the next thing I'm going to judge it on is functionality. To see if it works properly. Okay, so let me get my uh, pipette tips. <laughs> So I got the P1000 pipette tips. Let me get my uh, Eppendorf tubes. I got some water. Water. So what I'm planning to do is set this to 500 microliters. 500 microliters. And I'm going to withdraw 500 microliters from this Falcon tube to an Eppendorf tube. Okay? <laughs> okay. Fuck, is that an air bubble? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding? What the fuck, Eppendorf? Okay, let's do this again. What the fuck? Am I just doing it too fast? Maybe I am doing it too fast. Let's go slower. Oh my god. I keep getting an air bubble. Okay, what the heck? Come on, Eppendorf. See, okay, so I have to go slow for it to not get an air bubble. Let me just, just for shits and giggles, I'm gonna go really fast. It went all the way up here and it, it touched the tip of the pipe. I'm not, I don't like that. Huh. So functionally, I would give this, I would give this a 5 out of 10. Like, what the fuck? It took me like so many tries for, for me to not get an air bubble. So for that Eppendorf, for that Eppendorf, for that Eppendorf, I'm giving you a 5 out of 10. So the next one I'm going to look at is the P200. P2... Honey. The P2 Honey. Appearance-wise, I like it. Um, similar shape as the P1000. I think they're identical shape, actually. Like, they're... Nope. The, tip is, the tips are slightly different. I like the color scheme. I like this shade of yellow because it matches with this dark gray and this light gray. Also, I think as a duo, these two colors go together. So, appearance-wise, I would give this a 9 out of 10. A 9 out of 10. Okay, Evendorf, you, 
you winning me again? Next thing I want to judge it on is comfortability. It has the... It's it's similar to the P1000. I mean, it would make sense because they're the same brand. But it's, it's also comfortable. It fits in my hand. I don't have to push too much or too hard on this. I would give it a 9 out of 10. Yep, I would give it a 9 out of 10. It feels very comfortable. The next thing I want to judge it on is functionality. So let's see if it's better than the P1000. Oh, okay, let's do it really quickly. Oh! I like, I like the P200. I like it because no matter how quickly or slowly I withdrew water out of the Falcon tube, there were no air bubbles. And same thing with dispensing it into the Eppendorf tube. It was, it was pretty easy. I would give this a 10 out of 10. The next one I'm going to review is a P100. P100. Right off the bat, if I did not see this, the 100, or even these numbers, I would have gotten these two mixed up. The only difference between these two are the ends, okay? I just don't understand, like, why why two yellows? That's That's what I'm wondering. Out of all the colors on the rainbow, why choose two yellows? Like, why not make this orange? Besides the color, the color scheme, um, it looks, I mean, it looks almost identical to 200. So I, I just, I don't know what to say, I guess. Appearance-wise, I would give this, like, I'm gonna give this a 2 out of 10. It's, it's just kind of lazy, Eppendorf. G give me a reason! Next, I'm going to judge it on comfortability. Yep, I mean, with the other ones, it feels very comfortable, fits in my hand. So, um, just to keep it brief, I'm going to give this a 9 out of 10. Let's see it, let's test it out to see if it works. I mean, it may look ugly, but who knows, it might be better than these two. Oh, oh my, that, 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 that gets me. Oh, okay, let's do it really quickly. Oh, let's do it really slowly. Oh my gosh, this is really good. So it's just as good as the P200. I like it. All right, so functionally, I would give this a 10 out of 10. Yeah, I know that meme. Little kids be drinking water like... <laughs> water stay hydrated i'll be looking at the p20 right now the p20 henty so adds adds shaking effect zoom in shaking effect are you fucking kidding me ebendorf why do y'all choke Three yellow colors, like, one could have been yellow, one could have been orange, one could have been green, but no. Out of all the colors, y'all chose yellow for these three. Which intern decided, hmm, I want to choose, I want to choose yellow for all three different sizes. I cannot stand this company. Um, appearance-wise, uh, I mean, the color scheme looks good individually but if i were to compare it as a set I, I would i would give this a i would give this a one out of ten all right so the next thing i want to look at is comfortability okay so it fits my hand but one thing i am noticing is that you do have to push down a little bit harder with this one compared to the previous three yeah with p100 p200 and the P1000, I think out of all of them, uh, the P1000 is the lightest one where you don't have to push too much or too hard. Whereas the P20, you do have to push down with a little bit more force. Uh, and I can see that if I'm using this for a longer period of time, this would probably hurt my thumb after like maybe an hour or so. 
So, hmm, with that being said, I'll give the P20, I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Yeah, 7 out of 10. Next thing I want to check out is, is it functional? Do it work or do it not? So let me get my Eppendorf 2. Oh, mm -mm. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a small air bubble. It works, but if I go too quickly, an air bubble will show up. Yep, an air bubble. Um, mm. So, mm, I guess with the P20, I would give it... Um, is it functional? Yeah. Is it the best one? No. I would give this a 7 out of 10. No, I'll give it a 6 out of 10. Yeah, 6. 6 out of 10, yep. I'm not over this yellow color. So, overall, um, P20 is aight. It aight. It a wonderful. Like, out of the, the previous three, I wouldn't say P20 is the best one. The last micropipette that I'm planning to review is the P10. The little vibe. Okay, right off the bat, I like the color. I like the shade of gray because it matches this shade of gray and then with this lighter gray and also the subtle blue from the logo and from this other text, Research Plus. I like this. I like, appearance wise, I will give this, I will give this a nine out of 10, okay? Because if I were to look at this micro pipetter with P1000 and like, with a P200 or P20, P10. These three, I think the color scheme is amazing. All right, now let's see how comfortable it is. Okay, fits in my hand. First, let's set this to a higher number. I feel like you do have to push down a little bit more, but not as much as the P20. But you do have to push down more compared to the P100. P200 and P1000. Yeah, but it's not as bad as the P20. I mean, comfortability, I would rate it an eight, an eight out of 10. So now let's see if this baby's functional. I got my water. Oh, okay. So when I go quickly, uh, there are no air bubbles. But when I go slowly, no air bubbles. So, overall, it's not too bad. Functionally, it works, so I'll give it a 10 out of 10. I would say that the P10 and P20 are not my favorite ones. I like the upper ranges, the P100 to P1000. The P1000 is pretty good, but I'd probably say my favorite one is the P200. And my biggest concern is that these three are just the same colors. It would have been better if they chose other colors. They all work very well and they're also comfortable. So um, appearance wise, I'd rate them, I'd rate them an 8.5 out of 10 as a group. Uh, functionally, I think they all work very well. So I would give it, mm, I would give them a nine out of 10. And comfortability, I would give them, I would also give them a nine out of 10. So Eppendorf, great job. I cannot wait to review other products. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching my video. If you liked it, please like and subscribe to my channel. I'm planning to review more scientific products. So if you guys want me to review a specific brand or product, please comment down below. Until then, I will see you guys next time. Damn, Darren, where'd you get that sweater? Oh, well, I know y'all be asking me all these questions. So, I am selling this sweater on my website, which is labshenanigans.com. I don't know if I can put it in this video, and if it's not in this video, then I'm gonna put it in the description down below. So, if you guys wanna buy it, labshenanigans.com. All right, bye guys.